Alright, I think I've got some form of frame together. Um, with a 4S 2200 Zippy Zippy compact battery, it's just about those posts, it's okay. So the nasal go in the middle, uh, the receiver I'm not 100% sure about, and the GoPro is going to go on the front. As you can see, there's going to be uh, mounting holes there. Now, also, this is for. If I can get this in the right place, no, hang on. That bit there is so as you can put the guy, the uh, Mobius mount. And you just clip that into place. So you can actually mount the Mobius just with zip ties in the two holes or the four holes. Now I don't know where I'm going to put the um, the receiver yet. I was thinking of there, but that's going to be in the way then. It's just not going to fit. Back to the drawing board. Right, I've cut the pattern out and stuck it onto uh, the carbon fibre. Incidentally. This, um, there's many different types of carbon fibre. This is genuine uh, 3K uh, weave. Now, with other carbon fibre, you've also got um, G10 reinforced. Hang on. So that's a G10 reinforced. Um, I don't know if you'll be able to see this, but that is very, very flexible. This one is a genuine carbon fibre, and even that, that's one and a half mil, and that's it is quite flexible. This one, it's got a shiny top, which has got a protective coating on it at the minute, and on the underside it's matte. So, but it's a hell of a lot stronger, and I mean, a hell of a lot stronger. You can just about bend the stuff. So I've got that for the top plate and then I've got a 2mm for the bottom plate, uh, the middle plate and the bottom plate and then I've got a 3mm which is no way I can bend that nothing for the arms so I'm going to make two sets of arms, I'm going to make some for um, 6 inch props and some for 8 inch props and I'm going to cut it on my Dremel I've done the top plate. As a comparison, there's a standard 230mm or 250mm. So the GoPro, if I can find it, the GoPro will sit in the front. Obviously, it'll be like that. And that'll be to protect the GoPro. And also working on the mount, an adjustable mount, so as you can tilt the camera back. So it's not a perfect job, but. It's very strong in comparison. I mean, this is this is two. Uh, is it one and a half mil? And that is just as strong. It's amazing stuff. It really is. Right, the middle plate and the top plate are assembled. Well, I've just assembled them to see what they look like with the um, black nylon standoffs. That's looking okay. And also here I've got the arms and the bottom plate which is going to be a solid piece. There's going to be no holes, no nothing. Uh, which will become apparent when I've put it all together. And as you can see it's 3mm carbon. Focus. So that's going to be a bit of a Bit of a nightmare to cut out, but we'll see. So it's slowly coming together. Right, here's the bottom plate. 
and as you can see it's um, it's a solid plate uh, purely because of the mountings for the, the anti-vibration dampers I haven't put the mounting screws in there yet um, for rigidity now the rigidity of this is just absolutely ridiculous you, you just can't can't bend it so what I was going to do was go for the Tiger MN 2206 the 2000 kV but looking at the 2204s I thought I'd go for them instead running them on 4S so I'll mount one see what it looks like Right, as you can see it's nice and mounted there's plenty of space there for impact to protect, try and protect the motor a bit um, the only thing about this 12k carbon with the 3k sandwich on like, top bottom is as you can see it's not it's not glossy on the bottom but it doesn't bother me at all this is just a prototype just to see if it works alright so like, that will go on there like that and then it will have four of them well, I've got the motors on, all four of them done. I've also done the ESC wiring, which is a masterpiece, absolute masterpiece. So now I've got to put the, um, I've still got to take a tap off here for battery pack um, voltage, and then I can put the top plate on and start wiring it all up. As you've seen, I've got the motors on. Also, underneath, there's some um, legs. Um, got the top plate on, which is mounted with these anti vibration mounts. Um, Eagle Tree vectors installed. I've got to um, wire up the ASCs. And then I'm going to put the, uh, the top plate on. Yeah. Right, it's finished. I uh, I took the um, the eagle tr eagle tree vector out. Uh, I tried it in the in the living room, and it just doesn't like it. I couldn't be bothered to tune it, so I took it out. So I've now got a nase in there. Um, battery at the back, obviously. Uh, Neo 6M on the top, GPS and compass, and GoPro on the front. Tiger MN2204, I think these are. Where are you? Or 2206. Can't read it. So, the only thing I've got to do, I've got to make a mount for that because the, the GoPro is actually in the way there. Oh, incidentally, what I've done is I've mounted all I've done is mounted it on some moon gel just for the time being until I make a, a proper cradle for it. Um, but even that, I mean, that's solid, it, that's you know. So, there you go, the final product. Now, I've got to go and see if it will fly.